Yeah, welcome back to BelizeAndHitMakers.com. Happy 2019 to everybody. Hope everybody have a great year, prosperous, and with a lot of success. So today we're gonna learn how to tune the drums in dance hall to make sure your drums are in the right key as the melodies. Before we get into the video, guys, please subscribe, like, and comment, and keep you know keep sharing. I really appreciate the feedback. So we're gonna use drums from the Blue Hole kit that's coming soon. Let's find some. Okay, let's use this snare like this snare. Alright. Let's go. Good kick for now. Alright, let's get a hi hat too. Just to give it a vibe for right now. Alright, so we're gonna go with this drum just to show you guys how to tune it, right? So let's play out with the melody. Yeah, I'll bring down the melodies a bit, you know, because it's not mixed, but for the purpose of this video, we're gonna just play it lower. So why tune your drums? Some of the main reasons you want to tune your drums is because the drums give the song the energy and the feel and it also glues everything together so just trust your ears guys and based on the melody or based on the key that you're using you'll see if you need to tune the drums or not because not, not all drums need to be tuned right so let's start with the snare and the melody just to hear how it sounds I'll show you the way that I normally do it first I will just change the key, the root note. And you notice that one is higher. Yeah, I like it in that um, lower note. Another way to change the pitch is if you use Edison which is a longer method, but let me just show you guys still. You can drag a sample in here and time stretch and you could adjust this pitch course knob in FL Studio. Send it again, bring it down. And you can just basically drag this onto your pattern. Also, another way to get your um, drums tuned is to use new tone in FL Studio. Similar concept, you drag your sound in and you can um, play with these knobs and move the key. Just click on the key that you want. Yeah, you could just click on this to change the key. And from there you could save save as a sample you know and call it um let's say new steer small snare two i'll save this one in my kit as well and from there you could just drag it in right but we're not going to use that method for this one we have our snare let's link this to our mixer track track number three And let's hear the kick. We're on track number four. And let's find a key that matches. Higher sounding kicks. Yeah, 
Yeah, I will go to a lower sounding to match the, the high sounding snare, right? So it has a balance. Uh, all right, and with just a kick on the snare, you could already tell that it grooves a lot better. All right, and the hi hat. Let's listen to the hat. Put it on a mixer trap. Uh, cut out some of the low frequencies on the hi hat. Yeah, only using the frequencies that you need, right? All right and let's change the key. So yeah, there you have it guys, that's how you change the key and tune the drums. <laughs>